Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Biological. My name is Shivansh Gaur and I would like to tell you that today I am going to teach you a very interesting topic that is what is lichens. Lichens, it's a small topic, it's a small thing. What are lichens and what are its different types? Yeah, okay. So and now before moving on towards our today's topic, I would also like to tell you that I am the plus educator on Unacademy and you can get my live lectures on Unacademy learning app. So if you want to take my live lectures, if you want to see me live on Unacademy, you download the Unacademy learning app and follow the following instructions. After downloading the Unacademy learning app, you can take the Unacademy plus subscription. And before that, you should also know the benefits of taking the Unacademy plus subscription. In that, you will be getting premium content. You get premium content at a very affordable price. The cl classes are structured. You get structured live courses and dedicated live doubt clearing sessions. So there are dedicated live doubt clearing sessions. There are structured classes. The quizzes, they are organized at regular intervals, which are very important and necessary for your self-analysis. So you'll be getting quizzes at regular intervals for self-analysis. The batches are there for complete preparation. So there are different batches which are starting every month, which gives you an important insight to the different aspects of the preparation. And uh, the batches are specifically there for you for your preparation and comprehensive preparation. So batches are there for complete preparation. The test series for DPPs and also full length mocks are also organized. And the, you know, these tests, they are done with the analysis as well. So the analysis part is also done after the test after the full length mock test the analysis is done by the educators themselves okay now all of this you are getting at a single subscription and single subscription gives you unlimited access you use this code live shivansh when you use this code you get additional 10 percent discount okay so you are supposed to use this code live shivansh okay now, the 12 month plan is for 2375 and 6 month plan is for 10125. You have to use this code Live Shivansh to get these prices. All the batches are dedicated to cover the syllabus entirely. Now, the Telugu batch is also started. The Telugu batch has also started for the students who face difficulties in other language who are very comfortable with the telugu language there is a specific batch also for the telugu students so what else you can ask for on the unacademy you are getting everything you want just go for the unacademy plus subscription take the uh, subscription by using this code again the code is live shivansh do not forget to take the unacademy plus let's crack it so download the Unacademy learning app and take the Unacademy plus subscription to take my video lectures live. Now we will move on towards our today's topic which is lichens, which is lichens. You must have come across this term lichens a lot. In biology it has been mentioned a lot of times and uh, you need to know what is this lichens and what are its different types. Okay, see lichens it is a symbiotic relationship it is a symbiotic what is a symbiotic relationship it is it is a relationship in which both the organisms the organisms the interacting organisms they are both beneficial to each other when both the interacting organisms they are beneficial to each other they are beneficial to each other it is represented as plus plus which means it is a beneficial relationship between both the organisms okay so it is a symbiotic relationship and this type of relationship is also called as mutualism it is also called as mutualism 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 means what mutually beneficial for both of them that is plus plus relationship symbiotic relationship okay so now see in this lichen there are two interacting species and the two interacting uh, you know organisms they are first is algae okay and the other is fungi one is algae and the other is fungi these are the interacting species or the interacting organisms here okay the algae is known as the algal component algae is known as the algal component also called as the phycobiont it is also called as phycobiont phycobiont and fungi is also referred to as myco Biont. Now the question arises: How are these 
fungi and algae they are mutually beneficial to each other how are these algae and fungi they are mutually beneficial to each other so the thing is since algae you know uh, it contains photosynthetic pigments it is able to do photosynthesis the process of photosynthesis so algae you know with the help of photo synthesis it prepares what it prepares food it prepares food it prepares food okay and fungi you know fungi as you know that fungi uh, majority of fungi they are saprophytes and uh, they also help in mineral cycling and you know mineral uh, like breaking down of the complex material into the simpler components into the minerals and you know it increases the fertility of the soil as well so the thing is fungi it helps us it helps the fun uh, algal component to you know to absorb in the absorption of absorption of mineral nutrients everything from the soil in the absorption of minerals or it provides the mineral nutrients to the algae algae requires mineral nutrients to grow while fungi needs food fungi needs food so the thing is algae provides food to fungi and fungi provides mineral nutrients also kind of shelter to fungi so this is a relationship between algae and fungi the algal component is called as phycobiont and the fungi you know the fun fungal component is also known as mycobiont and both of them they live together and they are you know they are so much together they are you that you won't be able to you know, differentiate between the algae and the fungi component when you see the lichen you will not be able to differentiate that the yeah okay this is algae and this is fungi no they are so together that you know it's a symbiotic relationship and they cannot survive the algal component of this lichen and the fung fungal component of this lichen they cannot survive you know without each other without each other so they, that is not possible for them so the thing is they always live together and this relationship is called as lichen okay this uh, both of them together they together form the lichen the relationship is symbiotic that is plus plus mutualism is there okay now we will see what are the different types of lichens so you know you, you see that there are three types of lichens on the basis of their structures okay so there are three types of lichens there are three types of lichens they are three types on the basis of their structure okay the first is the first is crustose the first is crustose crustose is point like point like you know or flat point like or flat okay so their structure their structure is point like or flat structure they are known as crustose they are known as crustose lichens if you see the example of it the example is calloplaca callo placa callo placa is an example of crustose lichens then you have another type which is folios okay folios folios lichen folios lichen they have leafy structure they have leafy structure they have a leafy structure and if you see the example of folios lichen then it is hypogymnia hypo gymnia physodes hypogymnia physodes this is an example of a folios lichen they have leafy structure okay and if you see the another type of lichen it is fruticose fruticose lichen is basically branched and filamentous So this is a branched and filamentous filamentous lichen. This is a branched and filamentous lichen. The example is, if you see the example of its, uh, you know, it is Asnia australis. Asnia australis is an example of fruticose lichen. So these are the three types of lichens. These are the three types of lichens based on their structure. Based on their structure, the crustose lichen is point-like flat, example calloplaca. Folios is leafy structure, example is hypogymnia physodes. And fruticose is branched and filamentous and its example is Asnia australis. So this was all about lichens. This is all you need to know about lichens. In the next video, we will talk about something else. Till then, take care. Bye. -bye.